And let's uh, switch gears. Let's go talking uh, women, wine and shoes, wine, women and shoes. I well, say, it's two right? of Jeff Mars three favorite things. <laughs> right. And I, I'm guessing what was the one that you didn't like? It was wine. Not a big fan of wine, yeah. so you know what I do like. <laughs> oh yeah, we know. I wish every day could be like this. I bet you, you do. Both look fantastic. Thank you. These are the models that we brought in for this event. Wine, Women and Shoes is happening tomorrow in Roseville at the Galleria and we featured this last year. In fact, our own Monica Woods was one of the models, if you recall, and it's all about wine, women and shoes. That's why the event is called that. And I'm a huge fan of shoes. In fact, I am wearing my favorite pair of shoes right there, but it's not about men's shoes, Dan Kiba. It's about women's shoes. It's about high heels. By the way, Friday is casual Friday at News 10. If you were to see Dan Elliott's feet, you would notice that he's wearing tennis shoes. This is the one day I actually look better than Dan Elliott <laughs> with my shoes, really right? Any shoes. Uh, yeah, we're getting a shot of his shoes right there. Uh -oh. <laughs> Casual Friday, right, Dan? They're Chucks. Yeah, they're exactly. Like, they're Chucks. Well, I mentioned the models. We've got Laura Vickford here with the Rockland Chamber of Commerce, but I am calling you a model today because you look fabulous and you're modeling off some high heels, and thank you for coming in to do that. Thank you, Jeff. Are you a big fan of high heels? I am. I love the high heels, and I'll rock them. I don't care how old you are. I think you should be wearing high heels till you're on your deathbed. You know who else is rocking it is Alina Klavchuk. Now, why, do you, why did I pronounce it that way? Because she is competing for Miss Russian California, and I'm not afraid to pronounce my Russian names correctly. Were you impressed? Yeah. Kravchuk. 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 Okay, I'm close, I'm <laughs> close. Now, for that competition, that's coming up very soon. Yeah. Uh, I think uh, things are gonna looking good for you for that. Is that kind of like a Miss USA type thing? It's an annual beauty pageant that where they choose one girl to represent the Russian community. Okay. So yeah, it's pretty much, it's very similar. All right, well, let's have you girls go and do a little show over there on the left side of our studio. I'm just gonna have you walk in circles um, for the next half hour or so. <laughs> and uh, while they do that, I'm gonna bring in Diana uh, Ruslan. She's with the Rockland Chamber of Commerce. Why don't you scooch down here and just tell us about this event that's happening tomorrow. Well, it's a wonderful event. It's our first event in Placer County, Wine, Women and Shoes. And it's, um, we'll, we'll be joining uh, Keaton Raphael Memorial and the Rockland Chamber. And it's gonna be at the Westfield Gallery Mall in Roseville. Very exciting. Well, and it benefits a good cause. Yes, uh, Keaton Raphael Memorial is a memorial that supports children with cancer and their families to really navigate through the financial and emotional support that they need during this real tough time with their children. Well, you know what? We're looking at some of the shoes that uh, these models are showing off here. When we talk about shoes and high heels, it seems like they are constantly evolving. I noticed that she's wearing the studded and the studded is in now. Do you think that'll be in for a while? Oh, the holiday season, you're going to see high sparkly shoes and they're amazing. And every year they get a little higher and I think it's great. You know, I, I would love to develop my own high heel uh, line. I know that sounds a little weird, but I've always wanted to create these uh, lava lamp high heels, uh, you know, where they're kind of like see through plastic. They have little lava bubbles through them. It uh, you know, it's creative, right? And it will make a statement. And it will make a statement. <laughs> All right, we have some information for exactly when and where this is going to take place. Let's put up that information for you. Happens tomorrow, 1 to 5 p.m. Their website is winewomenandshoes.com. General admission, $75. But it sounds like it's worth the ticket with the wine, the women, the shoes, the handbags, and some food as well. Yes, you'll, everything will be there exclusive right in the center court. Okay, well, they were wanting me to try to put this on Dan Kiba, so I'm going to try to slip this on my big size 12, okay? Yeah, not even Cinderella could not even that one on. Not even Alrighty. close, no. right? No. All right. No. <laughs> nice try. And you know what? That Keaton Raphael, that was a story that has News 10 roots. It was back in 1997. His mom, Robin, came on News 10 Midday. They had just lost their son, and they began a series of fundraisers. We've done St. Baldrick's with them over the years. Okay. That's where the kids yeah. shave their heads. And, and his mother, Robin, she just embraced the challenge uh, after the loss that they suffered and she's done a lot of work to try to raise uh, money for cancer research so we applaud all, all of, of you, you for chipping in on this That's well and it's fun. a great thing too because last year in Sacramento County this fundraiser raised over a hundred thousand dollars for cancer research so it's a, it's a good thing that's terrific yeah. thank you all and ladies oh they look good they look great yeah, yeah. just stand there just stay there yeah. okay all right thanks Jeff <laughs>